Ooh, look at that cheese pull. Ooh, wee. These Cuban sliders are absolutely scrumptious and are packed with flavor. Very easy to make. Let's go ahead and make some. You are going to start with Hawaiian rolls. Look, I'm not doing 12, okay? I'm doing four. It's just me all by myself. I'll leave the recipe for 12 in the comments. But for right now, as carefully as possible, slice the top off of your rolls. And all you're going to do is add Swiss cheese. I love cheese. So to this, I am adding three slices of Swiss cheese. This is going to give you that nice cheese pull that you saw. Then you're going to add some cooked ham. You could use deli ham if you want to. I like to cook ham because it's thicker and it gives you more of a bite. And then you're going to add some kosher pickles. These are nice and juicy. They're going to add that good crunch to the sandwich or like I, I like to say texture that all sandwiches need. And then guess what? That's all you have to do. Wait a minute. I... I forgot which way the, the top goes on. Let me see if that, okay, it works. All right, all you got to do is, oh, shoot. Did y'all see that? That pickle fell off. Okay, no, we can't have that. All right, this is totally impromptu. I need to fix this. What we're going to do is don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. I'm going to put another piece of cheese. You can't have too much cheese anyway. I'm going to put another piece of cheese on top of here, and this is going to make sure that my pickles don't fall off when it's time to eat the sandwich. So three pieces of cheese on the bottom, a piece of cheese on the top, and cover it with the top of the buns, and there you go. It's time to put these in your baking dish. Look at this. I know, right? Look at this. This is perfect for my four sliders. Oh, my goodness. Come on now. You know that this is adorable. Oh, it's so sweet. It is time to top these with some butter and also some brown mustard. Ooh wee. So you're going to put your brown mustard in the butter and we are going to mix these up. And this is going to be a sauce that we're going to pour over these sliders. Make sure you taste it. And it's to your liking. I want mine a little bit spicier, so I'm going to add that brown mustard. Now, we could put the mustard directly on the sandwich, but no, we're fancy around here. So we are going to chef it up. I'm going to use our pastry brush. Yes, a pastry brush or a spoon if you don't have that. And you are just going to put this butter and mustard mixture all over those sliders look at that it looks absolutely scrumptious just go ahead pour it all over it just let it slide down the sides Ooh, we look at that sexy right there it gets even better we are going to top these with some chopped onions we are fancy okay we're not putting these in the sandwich we're putting these on top of the sandwich we are going to lightly cover this with some foil. Don't smush this with the foil. You just want to gently cover this with the foil. We don't want this to smash all the onions and the goodness we just put on top. You're going to bake at 375 for 15 to 20 minutes. Remove the foil. Bake for an additional 10 minutes. You're going to pull them out the oven and they are going to look delicious like this. These smell absolutely amazing. The butter has dripped down to the bottom, so they're nice and crispy. And let me show y'all. This is why I cut the ham, so when I pull them apart, they break evenly. And look at that cheese pull. That cheese pull is ridiculous. Let me show you one more time. Mm-hmm. Delicious Cuban sliders. Bon appetit. Let's eat.